<clears throat> oh, Davy, goddess, when will you, while you are eating, affectionately give me whose heart is dedicated to you the nectarian remnants from your lotus like mouth oh davy when will you while you are eating affectionately Give me whose heart is dedicated to you the nectarian remnants from your lotus like mouth. Shiragonatas <laughs> Goswami falls on the bank of Shirada Kunda and laments pitifully. Ha, Swamini, I am passing my time in great pain because the lamp of hope is still burning. If you are not merciful, then what's the use of my living in Braj? What's the use of my maintaining my life that is only burning in separation? Explain Gauranga Sundar. Radhe Radhe Gurudev. I will try to fulfill your order and desire. I read again, Lord. Ah, Swamini, I am passing my time in great pain because the lamp of hope is still burning. If you are not merciful, then what is the use of my living in that? Oh, Devi, Goddess, when will you, while you are eating, affectionately give me whose heart is dedicated to you? Yeah, this is the line. I swear. Okay, you the heart is dedicated to you. The nectarian remnant from your load, like now. Yeah, that's so we can see the very deep emotional prayer of Ragunata, who is addressing. Radhika, O oh Devi, my dear, my beloved, my goddess. And he is saying, My heart is completely dedicated to you. In my heart, there is nothing else than your name. Your form, your qualities, and your lilas. I am completely yours. And if you don't give me 
opportunity to serve you directly, then I feel I will die. But some hope, lamp of hope, is present. So that I'm ready to patiently, enthusiastically and patiently wait for your darshan and opportunity for direct seva. Because this lamp of hope is actually deep uh, reflection and sign of deep bhava which Raghunata has and he is swimming in that ocean of bhava. All his prayers which we can read and listen and meditate on them are actually spoke from this level of Baba. And this symptom is a great hope. And Radhika... Sir, sorry for interrupting. Here, can you speak a little bit louder or more closer to your mic? Just for us here, a little low okay. today. Okay, okay. Is it Thank better you. now? All right. Yes. Okay. So this bhava is the sign of his deep connection with Swamini and also closeness. And because of this closeness, he is praying, please give me, or no, he is saying, when will you, while you are eaten, affectionately give me. I am giving you my affection, but we can see how Radhika also is ready to give, reciprocate, anurag, give affection to her beloved maidservant, whose heart is dedicated to her. And Raghunath is praying from Prashad, remnants of food, but Prashad is not only remnants of food, so many things are prashad in this verse is mentioning remnants from food and king curry wants to eat only radicus remnants only and devotee is very eager to taste the remnants of his ishtadev he can respect other prashad a little bit, but he wants to drown in prashad and mercy of his own ishtadev. So in this verse we can see the remnants of food, but in other verses, and prayers, Raghunata is praying for Prashad of Radhika's glances, Prashad of Radhika's addressing him, Oh Tulasi, where are you? Oh Tulasi, come, come. This is also Prashad. This is also mercy. And he is showing us to make a short He is showing us aspirants, sadaka, how we should pray for prashad. And the, this prayer 
also has to be addressed to Guru. Because without Yasya Prasad or Bhagavad Prasad, without Guru Dev Prasad, mercy, we cannot attain our goal. And what is the goal? Nikunja Yuno Rati Keli Sidai. To help other Radhika's maid servants in the service of Nikunja Yuno. So this is the hope of Sadaka and also following the footsteps of Raghunath, following his heart who is burning in separation, but in the same time, it, there is a lamp of hope in his heart. And it only can be done from someone who is completely dedicated and fixed Ekanta and Adhika. I said, that's it. One thing I want to ask. Please go. Read again first. Oh, Devi, Goddess, when will you, while you are eating, affectionately give me whose heart is dedicated to you, the nectarian remnants. One. I know your heart is totally given to? Dedicated to me. To? To Shemati Radhika. To you, Radhika's heart is fixed on someone. Oh, Krishna. Mohan. That's the point. Your heart, I can see this. Your heart is fixed in one. And you only eat the food. Remnants. Remnants. And I want that one. Miss is a very deep teaching. You see, Prabhupada say, Give to me, I will offer the prasada. Right? Why? Because he knows that where to offer. He gives to Radhika and Radhika gives to Krishna and Krishna eats, then Radhika eats. It. And then devotee is take. That is the most important thing to understand. This <clears throat> is the way of the Raga Bhakti. And this is the way to process to us in our mind of offering a prasad. Guru Manjari is taking this and giving to Sri Radhika. Please, you give from your hand to Krishna and I know when he will eat, then you will take it. And when you will eat, then I will take it. The manjaris never take even Krishna Prasad directly. They take, give, bring to Radhika, Guru Manjari, and Guru Manjari is bringing to Radhika and Radhika is bringing to Krishna. That is the most important thing. 
if anyone is de- has deity and there is to them, they have to understand this. This is the process. And the prema come when you take the honey wine. It becomes honey wine when the both eat this reverence. And then what we eat is a very special vibe. So only the manjaris take the jutha, jutan of Radhika. Is a very important thing. <coughs> we never offer to Guru Dev. We got the request that you help me. I am not qualified to do <coughs> that. You offer, you know that you have a closeness with Radhika, you can offer this to her, bring this to her. And this process you know to do. To Guru Manjari. Yeah. We not offer to Guru Manjari, we request to Guru Manjari that you do this seva and teach me how to do it. This is the meaning of that. So this process, if we not do, we have to think and do it. So I request this very important line and the process. And after that, hope comes when we eat. And if I not get it, what is the use? What will the hope will come? Yes. <coughs> Thank you very much, Guruda, because you explained so clearly and simply the way of following from the heart, but also practically. Yeah. We say we are fed to Krishna. It's not like that. The Manjari only takes Prashtar, who is decide to practice this. They only do, they only take the reverence of Radhika. And they all wait for the Guru Manjari when they eat. When they offer to Guru Manjari, then they eat. At the point. <coughs> we offer in our Sadakriya or in the Mantra? If not, Siddha Deha come, we have to start with Sadak Deha. To, to Gurudev in his Siddha Deha, you help me. I don't know how to do. So Prabhupada teach, you say, I will do for you. Mm. But what we, we offer to Prabhupada, this is not a way. We have a, he said that you give to me, I will do. Means you don't know. This is the point. Those who are connected, Gurudev, they can connect us. They can bring to the right place. Right, they can offer. If not, then it will go wrong place. The very deep meaning of that. You understand? It's a very important point. Can devotion grow if the process is right? I want to see devotee. I want to confirm from that. I want to know, see them who is listening. They understand? 
How do you understand my request to you? <coughs> Only move your head, yes or no, then I can. I will. English, English, please. Yes, Gurudev, I will try. Uh, Gautama Muni is saying that uh, actually there is a, it's not only one prasad. It's actually is coming from Krishna to Radhika and Radhika to, to Guru Manjari and from Guru Manjari to devotee. This is so, why Mahaprabhu. This is Mahaprabhu. Mahaprabhu mm -hmm. means it's highest. Highest. Maha means Maha mantra, highest. <clears throat> Nothing <coughs> beyond that, that, that is the highest. What we need more than this. Mahamantra is why Mahamantra? If you know the meaning of Mahamantra is a beginning in our middle, of the way, a spiritual way, and it ends with that. So it's a Mahavata. Mm -hmm. Then why Diksha Mantra is there? Diksha Mantra is to open the crystal clear relation with the Panchatattva in a Chaitanya Mahaprabhu Navadip and to understand Guru Manjari, Krishna Tattva, Radha Tattva, Radha Mantra, Krishna Mantra, Kama Gayatri. When you will practice, you will know the meaning of Gopal Mantra, Kama Gayatri. Then Radha Mantra and <coughs> Kamagatri. This is the seed mantra. Then you know the mantra of Sakhi, Anang Manjari, and Rup Manjari. These are the leaders who help us. Pujan Sakhigan Prabhupada say, Atmani Vedan, offer yourself to Radha and Krishna, Radha Mohan. Atmani Vedan, there is offering yourself and worship to Larita, means all the Sakhi group, all Anang Manjari and Rupa Manjari, means or a Rati Manjari also. Rup means leader, means all in the groups worship. Pujan Sakigan to worship them and Atmanivesha. Prabhupada say everything in singing way and every mood he explain everything. Narayan Maharaj also explain everything. I am not telling anything new. I am telling their words that you can understand more crystal today. Rather, their words I am explaining. Rather, Tanandas Babaji inspiring to explain this. Rather, my Gurudev, all Guru Mercy. Radhe Radhe Gurudev, may I add something? 
Sure, you can ask. I had one, uh, just one, one feeling when I heard you talking, and I was remembering when we were reading about Ananda Das Babaji's uh, teachings and feelings. So he said, when there's when we speak about Chucky Bhav and we speak about oneness in feeling, that is Tathat Bhavik Chatmika, right? You remember this? Yeah, I got it. <clears throat> so, yeah. so what is coming now into my to my feeling is when I heard that beautiful that beautiful uh, text is that uh actually there we can see the intensity of tat tat bhavik chatmika in manchari bhav because they only wait till they get from their swamini uh, the remnants and when we talk about tat tat bhavik chatmika and chaki bhav then they want to take that also from krishna they want to take the remnants from krishna but that is different. So actually, when we see this, there is a oneness in feeling, but also there is a, a different, two different bodies. So this is, a, this is the unconceivable oneness and also to be different. This is Manchari Bhav, this is the Tathat Bhav and Chatmika, the oneness in feeling with the Mancharis, because they are one and at the same time different. But in the feeling with the with the in, in Chucky Bab is that they want immediately from Krishna this. This is what I just wanted to uh, to also mention because this is a very important point because there's always some misunderstanding in Tatat Bhavik Chatmika. Because sometimes they say it's Chucky Bab, but with Shakis, and then they say with Manjaris. But it's actually two, there's two different feelings inside there. In one as in feeling is one with, to be one with Radha and at the same time different. That's our bow, that's Manjari bow, that's Kinkari bow. But when we say one as in feeling and we want to do the same as Radha, actually imitating Radha, that is, that is the, the, the friendship. Not very clearly, I, I understand. So, a shaki would take why, the... Uh, why do you want to mix both wow here? No, that I don't want to mix. I just want to say that a shaki would take it directly from Krishna. No, no, please try to understand here, not shaki bhavka. They are not asking from Krishna. They asking from Radha, yeah. but no, Radha is only eating when Krishna takes, and she is taking only reverence of Krishna, Radha. So here, only Radhika, Prashad, Manjaris are taking. Mm. Manjiris are taking and not Sakhi is taking. No right. friend can eat with the friend Jutha. They will like to eat with the Krishna. No combination. Little mistake can be no clear understanding will come. DM Ramanji or Ramanji. Jaya Yes, brother Hare. I just wanted to add this. But he is not here, Canad. 
Here you cannot add tattar bhav chame. Asambhogatmika. They are taking from Radha. Yes. Clear? Yes, very clear. Yeah. Yeah. Go on, Gordy. Yes. So actually, without Srimad Radhirani's mercy, Krishna can never be attained. Yeah. Uh -huh. Without Srimati Radharani's mercy, Krishna can never be attained. Yeah. Many want to attain, but they attend where you know, back on Tamil. Alone Krishna, Narayan Maharaj standing, is in Dwaraka or back or back. And here Krishna of Radhika cannot be attended. You can attend Krishna in Vaikuntha and Dwaraka, but you cannot attend Krishna of Brajendananda. Without Shrimati Radhika's Radhika. mercy. It's always only through her mercy. Yeah. Comes yeah. one song of even Narottam. The, so, <laughs> even the level of the Sakas, you can only attend by her mercy. Friends also, and mother also, but again you come to Vrindava. Yeah. You are not attending. Alone, Krishna, you can attend with the friends help or mother help, but in Vrindava. In Chitai Chaitamita, in this shloka, no, Radha Dasi Yadi Hoi Abhiman, Sigra Mile Gopula Khan. Yeah. So we have that identification of being a, a Mandri of Radharani. We'll surely get Krishna because he will eat out of our hands. Yeah. No? The yeah. Manjaris will, he's also sold to the Manjaris because they can help him to meet his Swami. Yeah. So that's correct what's written here. Yeah. But from a Manjari perspective, we, why we want to attain him, actually. Oh. He's a Sakhi prospect. Krishna, huh? I will mind that Krishna. Sigra Mila Gopula Khan. Very easy. Very easy. Very easy. Sakhi well. Gopipa. Yeah. Yeah. Radhika Charana Reno Bushana Koriatan Anayase Pape Giridani. Anyone who decorates one's body with Radhika's foot dust easily gets Giridari. I praise any great soul who takes shelter of Radhika's lotus feet, sings Srila Narottam Das Thakur. Glory, glory to the holy name of Radha that resides in Vrindavan, and that is the jewel of Krishna's pastime. Fate has deprived me by not letting me hear the glorification of Radha. Uh -huh. A pillow bring, one pillow bring from backside. Anyone who associates with Radha's devotee and speaks about her rasa, her pastimes, and her love will attain Ganashyam, Krishna. 
but anyone who is against this will never attain perfection. Let us even not hear these people's names. These are the words of Naratam Das Thakur. Mm. Uh, Radhe Radhe. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Gurudev, we can see here in this beautiful song from Prema Bhakti yeah. Chandrika yeah. how many kinds of prasadama actually. Yeah. To put food dust on the body. Food dust of Radhika to put on the head, on the body, is prasad. Charana Renu. Charana Renu, yeah. And to, to sing the name, to, to come in the contact with the name of Radhika. Yeah. It is also prasad, Kripa and prasad. Yeah. Jaya Jaya Radha Nama. Yeah. Prashadam is also are coming from Rajavasi, the residence of Vridava. Yeah. Yeah. And we can see in the third verse associates of Radhika who are speaking her rasa are also sweet prasad for our ears. Their yeah. Mahavani are prasad for Doctor. our ears. Yeah. Wow, very good. Very nice. This is Radhika. This is growing your feeling thicker. These are the points to grow your feeling more. You cannot make Oh, brother, when you sing Krishna's name, you will get Radhika's lotus feet. Uh -huh. And when you sing Radha's name, you will get Krishna Tantra's mercy. Yeah. Radha, <laughs> I told Why you this. Pate, Hare Krishna, that we have to come to God. This is the mercy of he said, Hare Krishna, why? Because you can, in one time in life, you can go to the top. And when you will go, then you will change. Without going, <coughs> you will not come. You will be really a to get the Radha. If you get the faith in Radha Krishna, sure you will get Radha. Krishna will give Radha. Then, then, you can repeat it. Repeat it, bro. Oh, Krishna, in the Bhagavad Gita, Prabhupada said, when you assign with Krishna, then you will slowly and slowly reach the ultimate goal. It means that Krishna will send us to his dear beloved Srimati Radhika in her service, in her service. Right? Hi. <laughs> and also Srila Narottam Das Thakur says the same thing. When you sing Krishna's name, you will get Radha's lotus feet. And when you sing Radha's name, you will get Krishna Chandra. Yeah. They are so much connected. You will find it out. <laughs> 
<laughs> Manjari will not get it, but they will find it out for Radhika. Yes, you because, will find him. Uh, he will look for you. Uh, and, and he will look for you. And sometime when Radha is searching, you will find it out. Because Krishna will running come to talk with you. Yes. Because you are the Manjari. Yes. And your Manjari, your smell is also like a Radha. He will come out and he will catch me. What are you doing here? Come. <laughs> My Swami is searching. I think you lost your way. Come, yes, I'll show sir. you the way. <laughs> That's what Radharani gives her prashadi clothes to the Manjaris. Yes, oh. they're always just smelling like that. <laughs> <laughs> Same smell. Because the flavor of that cloth is never goes. It's flavor, it goes there. Same as who is decorating Swamini and who is put the flavor on her body. So they have similar. And you see Radhara Sudhanidi, Krishna is only from the Sari. From the veil, veil of the sari, the when wind. the flavor goes, Krishna, the where is the flavor coming? You mm. run that way. <laughs> and Naratom Das Thakur is saying, I told you this shortly. So he's like giving the essence to Dev. So now extinguish the pain in your mind. Uh, Don't become bewildered. They are eternally connected. And all other topics are simply miserable. Uh, <laughs> Sriman Mahaprabhu instructs us in chanting the dual Radha Krishna name which consists of 32 syllables, 16 words, and 8 drawings. Mahamantra. Yes. This mantra... This is Radha Krishna Mantra. Not Rama and Krishna. Radha Krishna Mantra. This mantra is called Avanatmaka mantra, which means that one can call out to the Lord with it. It is not just for silent meditation. Like you can call out with it. The best way to enter into the Nikunja Mandir and to serve Shiradika there is to congregationally chant this Hare Krishna Sambodhanatmakamana a mantra simply consisting of addresses. Srila Sanatan Goswami says the Sri Krishna Nama Sankatan is the most powerful means to attain the treasure of love for Krishna. It is like a most attractive mantra. The Lord will personally appear before anyone who chants this Nama Sankirtan with an innocent and eager heart. Eager means greed or greedy heart. Greedy heart. Uh, again, eager is career. See, never Narayan Maharaj feeling goes. If you know, you have to steal his words in heart. I steal this eager, greed, anything. What is like this? I, I steal from. Borrow, beg, or steal. I steal it. Beg, borrow, or steal. 
money is stealing me. You have to print out in your heart. <clears throat> this is beg and borrow a scheme. Print it in our hearts. Ah. I go, Mahajan Gatatu Pantha, means I go this way. Greedy. If my some material influence is losing my greed, I will done it first. Mm. That I will overcome from that. I will not involve myself in that. In the material body, it can happen. It's a good teaching, Gurudev. I feel that we have to overcome our material things quickly. Quick. Wow. We have to do it, but, but, wow. not, but not. Not not living in that. <laughs> yeah. Not sit in toilet. Yeah. But every time when his pressure come, we get there. <laughs> this is the point. Mm. Somebody goes and make the nice toilet to sit there. <laughs> when the home there. It's only thinking for toilet. <laughs> <laughs> this is uh, thinking for material world. Mm. Go and visit the toilet. If toilet is not coming, then go to doctor and check yourself. This material body is also important mm -hmm. because this has to balance. Mm -hmm. Sri Nam Sankatan will attract the most precious thing. Just like a perfect mantra. Yeah. For this reason, the bhakti rasikas, the relishes of devotion, have defined it as the fruit of devotion. No. For this reason, the bhakti rasikas, the relishes of devotion, have defined the maha mantra as the fruit of devotion. Mm. It is giving the fruit, and it is the fruit. It is always the most faultless way to attain the treasure of love of God. Someone may ask you, I thought that the goal of sadhana bhakti was prem and that nama sankatan was also a kind of sadhana. How can it be called the goal here? The answer to that is, it is true. Nama sankatan brings the treasure of Prem. And because the appearance of Prem is certain through the practice of Nama Sankatan, it is also called the fruit or the result of devotional practice. Why? Because it's a development that first you chant with the Nama Bas <clears throat> and not the maybe deep understanding. You are chanting with a, uh, like a habit or like a desire to purify, not like a definition of, of, of your Sambanda. Not you have no Ishtadev, you have no, you have not defined the relation Maybe because we don't have so much Sadhu Sangha and maybe we don't have especially Rasika Vaishnavas Association. So on the level of Vaidhi Bhakti or regulations and, and rules and, and many, many fears and, and religious impressions from many lifetimes, I am chanting like a, maybe sometimes like a machine for many years. I've done it also. I know how it feels. And then it becomes dry 
And then it becomes maybe some doubts come. Why am I chanting? You know, and it's no taste is coming. And then the next step comes. I want to find out my relation, my sambanda, and then abhideya, how to go deep. Then I have to go deeper in my understanding and my feelings of bhakti. I need more association of Rasika Vaishnava, of mercy of Vrindavan. And then I come closer to going deeper on the meaning of Mahamantra. Oh, this is Radha and Krishna. And they are dancing in the mantra. They are hugging. They are playing. And there's Lord Chaitanya's mercy. Lord Chaitanya, yes, I remember. Here is Radha and Krishna combined. Wow, and not only Krishna. No, I see now Radha Rani's mercy. I see how she is, is giving this nectar to of Prema and all these developments. And then also some fruits is coming or result is coming it's not only like a dry habit of practice can that I was, add something? yes good nama sankirtan is the only way to fix our mind mm -hmm. why we are chanting to fix our mind mm -hmm. But after chanting Nama Sankirtan, mind is not stopping. Again, he is thinking. You chant mantra, are you thinking different? This, right or not? This is the question. Yeah, this is happening. So, Nama Sankirtan is a priority to control this. And if you will go grow, you will add one thing, Leela Smaram. Mm -hmm. Nam Sankirtan with Leela Smaram will, you cannot go out from that Leela Smaram. It will be so tasteful to you that Nam Sankirtan and Bhajan Kriya, Kriya means Leela Smaram. Nam Sankirtan is also Kriya and Leela Smaran is also Kriya. You, because anything you think after chanting is a material thing. You what? I don't know your, you, but I, when I chant, I think like this materially. Still now, if Leela Smaran is not going on. Mm -hmm. Can we add then also for to relish now sing some kirtan and the last one that we need Sarup Nishta? Yes. After that, when we go in Lila Asmanan, then we see that this Mahamantra is also Lila. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mahamantra is also Lila. Yeah. We are also in Leela. He is a Maharas. So then Nama Sankirtan will also Leela Smaran will happen. In the beginning, in Nava Vahas stage, we not see Nama Sankirtan is also Leela. Mm. But when we make the mind little pure with Leela Smaran, and fixing mind not in material circumstances, then it becomes pure, then he start looking to the mind, he start looking, and Nam Sankirtan is also the Lanshma. It's a life, good day. This is the then the Leela Sparan bring you back. And when you go to the logic thing to understand, you listen very nice classes, but it's not Leela. So you not keep in your mind. But the past time is so sweet, it not go out from your mind. You want to be there. That is Leela Swara. You want to bring your mind out, but it's not going out. It's a sweet. 
And when it will start giving you a feeling of sweetness of Lila Asmara, then you see the Nam Sankirtan, how it play, how fast it's doing, it's how fast result is coming. And that is bhajan kriya. At the same time, two things is happening. Bhajan and kriya both. Our only regulative principle. <laughs> this is our regulative principle. This is the regulative principle in our inner consciousness. Outer consciousness regulatory principle is there. Mm -hmm. Because I am not pure with other circumstances. Mm -hmm. Some rule regulation is necessary. We we not learn from childhood this. Mm -hmm. But when we come, then we have to pure inside also. Inner purity will not come, outer purity will not work. So, Leela Asmana, Bhajan Kriya means the two things, Bhajan and Kriya. Anartha cannot come. You immediately Anartha will. When now the Leela is coming and name is going. That time really you use it. Jai Ho Gude. Also confirmed here by Ananta Das Babaji Maharaj. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Along with Smaran, uh, Nam Sankirtan swiftly enables the aspirant to relish the sweetness of Shishi, Radha, and Krishna. Yeah. And may I also add something more? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I remember the um, booklet that we compiled and also translate in German, The Hidden Path of Devotion, actually uh, conversations of Shilan Gurudev Narayan Maharaj with the, at that time in the 90s, Iskon, or, uh, Iskon Gurus, they want to know about Raga Bhakti and Raga Mark, and he was... Uh, explaining about uh, Srila Vishwanath Chakravati Thakur's explanation and commentaries, Raga Bhakti Chandrika, uh, Raga, Raga Vatma Chandrika. So he was also giving them the same uh, hint, you know, they were also practicing for 30 years, chanting and preaching and, you know, missionary works and so on. And they were wondering why they were not feeling so much or how they can advance, let's say like that. I cannot say how they felt, but they want to go further in Raga. And then he also said that, please, you, I advise you to chant with the Smaran, with the Lilas in your mind. Lila Smaran. And then he said the uh, Ladini Shakti, Srimati Radhika herself, will come oh, oh. and uh, help with the uh, processing, also with your devotional um, advancement. The Leela Smaran is uh, uh, Shimati Radhika herself giving us strength to continue on deeper levels of bhakti that he explained also to them at that <clears throat> time. Again, again, sorry. <laughs> 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 no, Shila, Shila Gurudev Narayan Maharaj also say the same thing, Gurudev. I just say that um, when we chant Maha Mantra with the mem memories of, of, of Leelas, of what we hear from Shimati Radhika, of Chaitanya, of, you know, with some feelings connected with the Maha Mantra, then Ladini Shakti will enter and, and help us advance quickly with these feelings. And how oh, oh, deep? Yeah, he said, Lord, Bhakti, Bhakti. yes, yes. He said it will be like uh, Ladini Shakti will kind of like enter into our heart by Leela Smaran. Yeah. Otherwise, we are, yeah, like we know everywhere in the whole universe. Mm. Smaran. <laughs> <clears throat> One more on this point? Yeah. Very easy. Why is um, 
Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is described as a Love tree, it. as a tree who's upside down, roots up, the branches down, because the roots are founded in the in the kunja. His roots in the kunja, and his branches here in this world, and he brought the Mahamanta left it to us in this world. So both are the goal. What is the meaning? When we go back to the roots, to his roots, we reach the Kunja. And even in the same, in the Mahamanta is also the Kunja. Mm -hmm. So both are, could be our goal, right? It's Prema is inside. We find Prema in the Mahamanta because the Kunja is in the seed, is in the mantra. Yeah. Mm. And if we go up, what he is giving us to the roots, same. There is Kuluka the Kunja. Yes. Kunja, both. Kunja is there and here. And you see there also. You can see both. You can see here and there. there. With the name, you can see here. Mm -hmm. And you, you can see from your divine eyes also. Wow. Beautiful. Sri Raghunath experiences this wonderful rasa of Sri Radha's sweetness in his heart. When the viewer sees a most lovely thing, he feels ecstatic and astonished. Yeah. So who is viewer? Who is the doer and who is viewer? Shiragonath experiences the wonderful rasa of Shirada's sweetness in his heart. When the viewer sees a most lovely thing, he feels ecstatic and astonished. So the viewer in this case can be Raghunath, who is like as Tulsi Manjari experiencing Radha's sweetness, but also we are viewing it because, because of the mercy of, of Raghunath Das, who is helping us to also become a viewer because he is our role model, right, Gurudev? This is the Guru Manjari is viewing and showing to us also. Jai Ho! Mm. And who is doer? Mahamantra. <laughs> doer. It's Radha and Krishna. Through the name and through the eyes of the Manjari. The eyes yes. of the Manjari. She yes. she see and she show us. Yes. Mm. And And this is the thread, this is the way to go there. This can only bring us to the root of this. We should always look into your eyes to... <laughs> <laughs> no, to, to, to the Pratima, to Rupa Mahatma. We all are Dasi. We are all friends for one goal. <laughs> yes, Shabba, my goodness, yes, if I can stay, just I don't know if it fits, but it's just a feeling. You were saying yesterday, Guru. Loudly, yeah. So you are far. I'm far. Yes. 
Keshav Baba was saying yesterday. I'm not. I don't know if it fits, but it's just a feeling I wanted to share because I was just feeling about Guru Dev and Guru Manjari. Baba was saying that you know we are a little foolish because we're looking for Radharani, but actually she's in the form of Guru Dev. She's present. We don't see her. <laughs> we are blind. So she's identical. No, Guru Manjari is feeling identical with Radharani. So if we concentrate, focus on our relationship with Guru Dev, with Guru Manjari, then she's there already. She's already there. She is there. We have two mantras. No? We get two mantras, uh, Guru mantras. One from this place where we are now, mm. and one up. Right? Mm. Uh, hmm? Yeah. I just wanted to say this. Like when, <laughs> right. when the manager is viewing and seeing and then sharing with Guru Manjari is viewing and sharing. So, so if we connect with our hearts to Guru Dev, then automatically also we'll be able to see. No, just have to believe. <laughs> Sure. Well, yeah, we experience it, especially here in Vrindavan. I, I must say for myself, it depends on my vision. Though. Sometimes I see Gurudev like an old man and sometimes very young and shining and, and feminine. Though. So mm -hmm. it depends on my on my consciousness, how I perceive. And when I when I have the switch no, by mercy also, and mm. then it's a different feeling, right? Yeah, that is nice that Keshav Baba was giving you this hint. Huh? Okay. Yeah, it's beautiful. You can speak with him in Hindi now. So there is there are two connections to the Guru. One is to the present Guru and one is to Manjari. Yeah. Guru. Two mantra. Two. Two mantra. Mm. So we can see you in the Sadakdeya. And we can see you in the Siddhadeya. Two possibilities, no? I see my good David there because he lived his side of the Jai Ho. Only and this is this is a very, very important point to me because I, many years I, I meditate on this. How can we be connected to our Guru Dev after changing? The body. And I always desire to be close to you in all circumstances, even if I leave bodies also close. <laughs> Who knows? Yeah. But I want to stay in this together with you and not leaving you. And this is possible by the Siddha there only. Oh, Shuna just made a love declaration. Jai Ho, a blessing. I also feel surprised <laughs> how he, without knowing any Vedas, Puranas, Sloka, how he got this opening mm -hmm. like a he is flowing like a fountain. Anything. You said one time it's like a fountain. Fountain. <laughs> Only sleep afternoon, some. <laughs> this is happening to we are also sleeping with Gurudev. No, Gurudev. Uh, sleeping with Gurudev and sitting. He never talks, but he's sleeping. And he asks, You eat or not? You do? <laughs> you, you. Or general talk, and only by sitting and sleeping and kirtan, all mercy come. I don't know. No much to know. Normal life, na? Guru. No much to know. <laughs> if you know many things, then you will confuse. <laughs> I one thing is a grief. Back borrow still. Only you practice this. All done. <laughs> Something Mahajan word is stealing. 
And he said, <laughs> I said, Prabhupada, Bhagavad Gita, I steal something from that. He said, the devotional practice is to develop relationship. Uh, develop relation and this devotional practice with so much deep that one relation will come. And that that is Sarup and Sarup Siddhi. Mm. This relation will move to the thicker relation, condensed relation will develop your Sarup. And what is sarup? Your condensed feeling is a condensed feeling. Yes. It's your sarup and siddhi. You you fix yourself, not jump here and there. This is perfection. Condensed relation and feeling is your sarup. Mm. Condensed feeling is your sarup. Believe me. Is Anandas Bhavaji word. When the feeling becomes condensed, is a sarup. Like your mother re condensed, become condensed. And you condense with the sun, you breastfeeding and everything do from childhood, it becomes condensed. And this is your sarup, mother. But so many times he become father of you. In previous life, but now it is you as his son and your father. Mother. Mm. Mother. Both. You see, this is the ch ch relation. <laughs> when the relation becomes condensed, is your saru. Mm. Not easy. Normal, easy to understand, yeah. Just be normal. Just be normal. Normal. Why you make complicated, yeah? Yeah. But to get greed, Gurudev, we have to understand that it is not an eternal thing that we are together. We are in, in this material situation that we have now. We have to understand that is temporary. This is not normal. <laughs> yes, right. This is right. not normal. And my ego is not normal, mm -hmm. making me. Right. My my material situation make me normal. My senses make me abnormal. Yeah. That's it. Abnormal. abnormal. Yeah. Abnormal. Not normal. <laughs> My situation, these are making up now. But you, you leave these circumstances, little one hour free with this, you're normal. Sweetheart. <laughs> 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 And on with Smaran, Nama Sankirtan swiftly enables the aspirant to relish the sweetness of Shishi, Radha, and Krishna. Sri Raghunath experiences the wonderful rasa of Sri Radha's sweetness in his heart. When the viewer sees this most lovely thing, he feels ecstatic and astonished. Yeah. The narrowing of his consciousness will cease and his consciousness will be expanded. Wow. Mm -hmm. So means Gurudev just to... Usually what we do is narrowing our consciousness now when we have this material feelings. But you when... See? No, it's simple. Yeah, narrow is a vast. I Make want to narrow it. A small, small. I room. want to small it. Mm. Yeah, with the material circumstances. 
narrow it. You can be unexpected. You can get the divine and everything is divine. We just that. Go to your garden home, see that. Then you see what is narrow garden. House is narrow. Here is you. How much far you can see? What is beautiful? Your siddha deha is beautiful. A sadhak deha is beautiful. And you are happy where? Why you want to narrow yourself? <laughs> And otherwise, yeah, like you said, the consciousness will be expanded. It's yeah. unlimited yeah. possibilities. Unlimited. This gift Prabhupada gave. This gift all my just give. Yes. So we have to expand or narrow? <laughs> <laughs> that both is, is in your hand. It's your choice, no? Your choice. You want to make yourself narrow or you want to be a... expanding. Expanding. You want to open your vision or you want to make close. <laughs> But they say good the path is very narrow. Yes. <laughs> path is narrow, yeah. but the place is very large. <laughs> path is narrow because in one group you cannot go there. No. You have to walk alone. You cannot take the highway. You cannot take the uh, auto one. <laughs> German class, no, auto one. <laughs> <laughs> you have to go by small trasse. <laughs> Lunch trasse, go Lunch trasse. <laughs> yes. In the forest, we have yeah. to go through the forest. Yeah. <laughs> That's why the Alankara Shastras the scriptures on metaphors call astonishment the life force of rasa. Mm -hmm. Means, uh, if I can just sum it up, when the consciousness will be expanded, when we come in contact with the sweetness of the feelings of our Guru Manjari or of our, our feelings have to be here. Yeah. Guru Manjari, feel what you will do that. No, but we connect, Guruji. First, I have to develop feeling, then I can connect. It. Okay. My feeling will be not there, connection will not be there. Right. Feeling connects us. Body cannot connect. No need to connect body. You don't need to connect your senses. You don't need to connect anything. You have to connect your feeling there. Mm. And Radharani also connect your feeling. Mm. So what to grow? Feeling. And feeling is coming from where? Check. What you think, that great grow the feeling. If you think for her, your feeling will go for her. I think for you, uh, my feeling will grow with you. Now you select, you want to, what feeling you want to grow? Understand? If somebody has a no relation with the Guru, because feeling goes different way. So it's not switch over, other way. Where you think that feeling will come. If so, we have to make the goal of the feeling what to think. Material and spiritual. When you have a feeling, you can see everything in large way. Expanded consciousness. Expanded way. 
your vision is not narrow material mm. you see the divine you can grow your way a vision in divine large inside of the person you can feel it but to meditate to divine that divine vision will come yes child divine vision can come with divine meditation Yes, this is here confirmed again, Guru. Dibba, Didi, the Dibba, Manga, na bada sula 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 The Shri Madhus Goswami's great passionate love for Radha that causes a wonderful astonishment in his mind and makes him thirsty for her direct devotional service. Yeah, <laughs> direct devotional. Not indirect. By by a media. Why through Guru? He is a navigator, yar. Feeling. He can give you if you think for her. Then you can feel her that he is connected or not. That's why you're like a director, no? You help Director. to grow. <laughs> Yes, you can say viewer. We are viewer, and they are actor. Mm -hmm. They are acting, and we are viewing. Mm -hmm. The act viewer, when you go to the theater to see, you have to keep your mind to viewing the actors. Mm -hmm. And one moment you fix the. Uh, boy side or girl side to fix. Mm -hmm. Then you like girl side. I like always girl side. <laughs> <laughs> From the beginning. So in Indian film, girls has a too much torturing and pain. So they have bhav. Huh? The girls have bhav in the movie. Yeah. And then I start crying wow. because I feel that feeling. So that feeling, when your tears come to you with that feeling, then your feelings become connected with that feeling. That is divine. It becomes divine. You start looking. You are used to this. So this is the feeling. <laughs> feeling is a feeling. It can be. अभी हम काम कर रहा है बेकूफ है सच बात नहीं करो अपने काम करो जो करना आप नहीं बनाए थे ना बनाए थे आपने बोला ना आप थोड़ा बहुत बनाए कौन Yes, the feelings, Gurudev, the feelings with the girls' party that bring the tears and the ah yeah they break me. <laughs> and you said also before it's important to understand that the uh, direct uh, he also Raghunadas Goswami as Tulsi Manjari has direct thirst for her direct service devotional service direct service no indirect this direct means direct. Not see it directly. Feeling cannot grow without direct service. Mm -hmm. Wow! Huh? So many nice points today. Really deep, would it? Direct service. Hmm.
and then direct service he will start, the vision will become divine. Then you can see Guru Dev. The outsource is, is the Dev. <laughs> that then you will see that thankful to this Guru Dev navigator, <laughs> he bring me to here. <laughs> my God, what is happening? How I can I can leave this navigator? Then your love will start. Your love not to start because you are not related with that. It. That's the point. Still, relation is in material service. Selfish. Selfish. Some benefit. Honestly, this is my realization. Order supplier. <laughs> order supplier. I'm still order, uh, ordering him and he's supplying. Oh, Amazon relation. Hmm? Yeah. All yes. become cold, my dear. Hmm? My coffee is cold. Make a little hot. No, only hot. Only hot. Hot, hot. hot. Oh, only coffee. Yeah. <laughs> 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 So, any questions, any sharings from all the devotees who are listening? Very small points I talked to them. <laughs> small points? But it's a very deep subject. These are the, honestly, these are the key. I after after um, I assess is my realization, so I'm sharing. It's small but very important. There is a book titled "Go the Smallest Little." <laughs> you, uh, I think that if you research some place, you can check right or wrong. But it's my. Are there any questions, Punya? Can you read? How can we condense our feelings, Gurudev? One question came from who? That the thing. Vandana. Vandana asking how can we, we condense? We can condense the feeling. Any condensed feeling. If the I say. Pregunta. Condense what you think. With your material mind, that will condense. How much time you give? Ten hours give to thinking one thing. It will condense after one month. Maybe faster. Faster, ten days faster. But it will condense what you think. So, if you think in Radha, Ten days non-stop, it will condense. Mm -hmm. In ten days you can get sarup, na? <laughs> <laughs> but that to try. <laughs> How to stop your ear, false ego? Um, that okay. when he will give you a chance, then you can stop. They will not give you a chance for the moment to go for right way. They will bring you out. So Vajan Kriya is important to stop them. This is the point. They will say, talk a different, different game for your, do you not become condensed feeling. One pointed to Radhika. They will give many logic, false ego will fail. How you can do it? 
understand by the other what is good. What do you think that you will become goodness? Right or not? Yes. <coughs> well, only one question. Only one question? Is there more Punya? Calling for Radhika, only to get Krishna. Yes. Calling for Radhika only to get Krishna, I would feel kind of cheated. Also, fast track, not the effort of the intensity. No? But it should go from the heart. Yo quiero hacer una pregunta. Devota, quiero hacer una pregunta. Eh, Gopi Karuna de Santo Domingo. Gopi Karuna de Santo Domingo. La pregunta es que, que si condensar es meditar, implorar, cantar, escribir todo con relación a Semati Radharani, que si eso es condensar para tener eh, como una, una idea clara de qué es meditar constantemente en Radharani o es cantar el santo nombre quiero tener eso claro si sí, uh, Ragunat Ragunat tu bist gefordert can you translate please Ragunat Rade Rade She's right. asking um, if if uh, she wants to make it very clear if condensing the the feelings means that that uh, or she should always do uh, concentrate only on Radharani with everything that she's doing um, that she's singing and chanting writing something and hearing and reading but also in his in her normal everyday life, only try to focus on Radharani and think on her if that is the, she wants to have it clear if this is the meaning of content, uh, condensing her feelings. Yes, right. Correcto. <laughs> Gracias. But it is all she do not give chance. <laughs> भजन <laughs> This become practice, not this life. So many life. Mm. Old habits. No. Old habits. Many things. Many up and down. Many things up. Sometimes it comes back and back. And right or not? See that? Every day. <coughs> you leave everything after they are not leaving you. You run away from everything, but they are not running away from you. Because my ego is catching, holding them. My ego is holding them. So, how to make peace to the my ego, false ego, 
Only bhajan kriya is the only help, no other help. Honestly, I say you. Translate, Kicho, who is translating? It's going on, going on. Going on. Interpreter, no? Background, she's listening. <laughs> Hmm. A lot to digest. So good. No. Thank you, Ray. All of your mercy that you tolerate me so long. <laughs> <laughs> you like or not, I don't know. <laughs> they don't say something to me. No, <laughs> How many are there? We had a 105 on Max. My God. You target me or not? Ask you that. <laughs> we love you. We love you. <laughs> yeah. 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 Uh. Unmute your mics and say something, brothers and sisters. Don't become mute. <laughs> oh, Maharaj, I wanted to ask about this kite lila from yesterday or the can you explain this maybe from, from Ram Chandra he was the first to raise a kite and it actually went to heaven I, I would like to know what is I mean do they also have this uh, lila in, in Braj like uh, Padan yeah Bajivati is that do. In our place, not is the Rajvasis are doing. In our temple, is not happening. But it, Skype is also, you see, a whole place in the world is going from the world. So, any mention of Krishna having a kite or something? I have no idea. I never. <laughs> you never have a kite. I am not collecting news. <laughs> I, you can ask about Radhika, I can share with you. Out of that. Does she have a kite? <laughs> I never see that. Yeah, I was not. <laughs> but if you come, then I can share with you. 